Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is April, 25 years old. I'm a nurse practitioner student, and I've been a nurse for five years. I'm graduating this week, but I'm technically not done until August because I have to do a pediatric rotation, but I am walking for graduation on Thursday. So this is a very exciting vlog. It's gonna be a week in my life. It's gonna include graduation. I have family coming in. So yeah, it's gonna be really fun. Um, and I'm glad you're here. But anyway, I'm having a bit of deja vu because this is exactly how I started my last vlog in the exact same outfit. My hair kind of looked the same, so it's just funny. But it is Monday morning. It's around 8.30. I woke up about a half an hour ago and I'm just making myself a cup of coffee. I'm gonna sit down and do, you guys know, like my big two, my devotional and my five minute journal. I really would like to start incorporating like some meditation into um, <clears throat> my morning routine. I do do usually like one minute or two minutes of deep breathing, but that's really it. So maybe we'll try to do that today. Today and tomorrow I am scheduled to work at um, the med spa, the IV bar that I work at. As of right now, I don't have any patients booked, so I only have to be there if I have patients. So. You know, obviously that could change as the day goes on, but I also, I need to be home until noon because I'm getting a package for a collab that I'm doing and I have to sign for it. So yeah, I had a really good weekend and my coffee just finished. So we're going to go over there. Okay, perfect. Um, I had a really nice weekend. <clears throat> we had a friend from high school in town, so it was fun to see him. And he's actually friends with one of our friends who from here so it's just like a very small world but it's fun to see him and then yesterday we really just chilled i have been working on deep cleaning this house so i'm going to continue doing that this week um because i cannot stand when my house is dirty but especially when like visitors are coming i'm like i want every inch of the house clean you know like when you're younger and your parents um you have people coming over and your parents are like go clean your room and you're like they're not gonna look at my room that is me i have grown into that as an adult i'm like literally washing my baseboards and my husband's like they're not gonna look at the baseboards I'm, but i'm like i know i just i want everything to be clean and if people are coming i might as well do that like deep clean that the house needs so anyway i have made a lot of progress but i need to clean the rooms that they're staying in in the bathroom today or tomorrow you're not coming till Wednesday so I have time but I ran out of cleaner so I need to go get cleaner today but anyway this is the longest intro ever so welcome I'm so happy you're here alrighty you guys we are headed to the gym We're gonna do um, <clears throat> an arm day with like, whenever I do, I'm doing Whitney Simmons, a live program. And I'm on week seven out of eight. I think this, it's a live strong. So it's the building muscle one. And I do like it. It does get a bit repetitive for me personally. I just can get really bored in the gym. I like to switch it up. But, um, that being said, it is not super repetitive. I just noticed that we are repeating some of the exercises more times than I would like to. <laughs> but there's only so many exercises you can do. So going to the gym, gonna get in a workout, come home. I might have to run by Target because I need some more cleaner so I can finish cleaning the baseboards. And And then we'll get home and start studying after, of course, like showering and stuff. But I have my exam on Thursday morning at 8 o'clock, which is so annoying um, because, well, that's, it's the day that I'm doing graduation. So that's why it's so annoying because I have to go there, have to drive to Tampa, and I have to drive really early because there's going to be a lot of traffic at 7 in the morning to get there at 8 gonna be a lot of traffic and then I have to be there for probably it'll probably take me like 45 minutes to take the exam and then I'll come home 
get ready and then have to drive back down there so that's super annoying but whatever it is what it is I can't do anything to change it and I'm just excited to get this class done because I'll talk more about it maybe next week when I'm done but this has been like the worst class I've ever taken the worst professor I've ever had in my entire nursing career it's just it's been atrocious so anyway we're gonna have a great day I'm in a fabulous mood so happy Monday we're going in to Target because I am out of cleaner um, like the all-purpose cleaner I don't think it's Miss Myers brand but it's my favorite sort of boy. this before just in a TikTok on how I study. Please ignore my dirty nails, which is throwing like a dirty ball with the, the dogs. But um, how I go through my PowerPoints is I will go through them from the beginning and then ask myself questions down here. So then when I go through back through the PowerPoint, I just refer to the questions really treats really quickly. So how do you treat urge incontinence? So urge incontinence is usually treated with anticholinergics stress urinary incontinence is there's no specific medications but you can use like duloxetine which is Cymbalta um, and some like alpha adrenergics and then postmenopausal UTI is usually treated with like vaginal estrogen which you can see is all from here but I will ask myself these questions without looking here so it just it creates um, like repetition in the brain and it really helps me morning you guys I am running late per usual um, I have to go to a little like work meeting it's a town hall they do it like every I feel like they do this all the time but I think it's supposed to be every six months and it's some stupid thing where they tell us like everything that the hospital is doing what they're building what they're putting their money into it's such a waste of time but I asked my manager, I was like, do I have to go to this? I'm just peering and she was like, I would really like you to go. It's like, dang, all right. Um, so I think, I think it's at 10. I took a picture of like the flyer and then I accidentally deleted it. Oh, my camera's about to die, cool. So anyway, I'm headed there. I've got a bowl of, um, yogurt, granola, berries to eat on the way. And then after that, I'm gonna go to the gym, come home and start like studying type of thing. But I don't know if I'll be able to show you anything because my camera's gonna die. So we shall see. sleep well last night and anyway we've got a full day ahead of us camper leave me alone for a second we've got a full day ahead of us at 9 30 i have let me throw this ball really quick <laughs> uh, 
um, at 9.30 I have to have a Zoom meeting with my clinical instructor. Come here, drop it. Um, we just go over like, um, make sure that everything is done for our, I'm like losing my train of thought. We make sure that we have everything done for our clinical hours, meaning like all of our hours are completed, all of our volunteer hours are in. Um, we have to do surveys and stuff like that, so we just make sure that that is all completed and done, and they say like, good job, and it's it's kind of a pointless meeting, it's like five minutes, so. We have that at 9.30, and then <coughs> Camper Stack. He has the worst like kennel bark, it's so annoying. Come here. Hoosier, come get this ball. <laughs> I, he really thinks that he's like in the Olympics for ball throwing. He's obsessed. But we have a dentist appointment. I'm going to do some studying. I'm going to go to the gym. Um, finish cleaning up the house. My um, mom and my cousin who is basically like a sister to me so I do call her my sister if you ever hear her say that if you ever hear me say that they are coming in tonight so I'm gonna pick them up from the airport um and yeah and then tomorrow is pretty big too my exam is at 8 a.m and then my graduation I have to be there at 2 and it starts at 3 so yeah, it's it's a lot going on the next couple of days. I'm tired. I might take a nap today. I'm feeling very sleepy, but yeah, that's the plan for the day. I need coffee. From getting my nails done this is the, I haven't had them done in a really long time and they look very good I'm like obsessed with the color can you see I'm obsessed with the color I, I don't know off the top of my head I know it's OPI so I'm sorry I don't think that helps anybody out but this nail I don't know if it'll focus on it it's not looking likely hello can you focus on this anyway you'll just have to take my word for it it is so long it's longer than the other pinky and it like it looks like a raven's claw it's like um dipped on the end so i'm gonna have to perform surgery because i was too non-confront i was too non-confrontational to do anything about it just something about me is i will never say that anything's wrong ever even i don't eat meat if i go to a restaurant and they bring me meat. I'm just like, I guess I'm not eating dinner tonight because I can't tell anybody anything. But I just got a package from Amazon. I just ordered a bunch of workout shirts. Um, just one came in the mail because I'm at that stage right now where all of my workout tops are kind of stinky because I've worn them a lot. And even though I obviously wash them, they just like, you know, get old and used and stuff. So this is cute. I ordered this. This is from Amazon. I like just like simple black or white or gray because I have a lot of kind of colorful um, workout pants and stuff. So I just ordered that. That's cute. I'm sure it will fit nicely. And I have not studied at all today, which is a problem because I have a test tomorrow, baby. What am I gonna do? Anyway, I don't really care anymore. I like know the information somewhat. I've studied for, I feel like I've been studying for at least like three days for this one test. And in any other class, I would put in a lot more effort, but this class is just, like I've said, I've had it up to here with the professor. Like I'm done, I don't care. I already have an A in the class, so. Mm, I mean, I'm gonna do well in the final. I'm gonna do good. I just have no motivation to do it. 
And I also need to just pick up the house really quickly, um, make sure everything is nice and clean because I'm going to pick up my sister and my mom tonight from the airport. My sister comes in earlier. She comes in at like seven. So I think I'm gonna like wine and dine her <laughs> and then we're, we'll go pick up um, our mom. Um, I think I'm gonna take her to Bar Taco and we'll just, um, the area around there is called Hyde Park. It's in Tampa, it's super cute and we'll eat tacos and maybe just like shop a little and then go pick up my mom so yeah i think i talked about it before she is not my biological sister but my parents did raise her um they never adopted her or anything but they raised her like their own so i do call her my sister but she is technically not but she's my sister so anyway let's go perform a mini surgery really quick i don't have a file like a nail filer but i know that my mom's gonna have one because something about moms they just have everything they are always prepared at all times my mom carries a file in her purse i know for a fact so i'm just gonna cut the nail down a little bit I'm building up a place to put you guys a hmm. little taller a little taller <laughs> Okay. Okay, perfect. Um, do I not have a nail clipper either? What? This is strange. I'm confused. All right, let me go find a nail clipper. Okay, I've located the nail clipper. Let's see. I know I tried to show you guys just a second ago, but. It's probably not going to focus, but you can see it's a little bit longer and honestly, it's just very like, like I said, it's kind of crooked almost because this one's straight and this one's kind of crooked and it just feels a lot longer. So I'm honestly just going to like cut the tip off and then I'll file it down when my mom comes because I cannot live like that. Yeah. I mean, I know it's like a blunt tip now but is it equal? yeah and then i'll just file it with my mom's filer when she comes i think i wish i would have i think i'm making this worse okay i just like evened it took a little bit off the sides and then i'll file it later oh my god good morning you guys it is a thursday morning i'm quite sleepy um i just finished my women's health exam it was a lot i don't think i did amazing but i definitely don't think i failed <laughs> um if i have to repeat this class which I don't know, that would be like a first time for me. I don't think that's gonna happen. Um, but you know, you never you never know, but I don't think that's gonna happen. The exam was out of 100 questions, so I would have had to miss, like a lot of questions, I would have to miss like 26 questions in order to fail the exam, and I don't think it went that way, so I'm just glad to be done. I really don't care what grade I get I have an A in the class, so I think I will be okay, but who knows. Um, anyway, I don't know why I'm being so negative about it. It was just a harder exam than she usually gives. It wasn't really what I was used to, but whatever. I'm done with women's health. I'm done with that professor. I hope I never, ever have to deal with her ever again. Um, and today is graduation day, so it's 8.55. I had to be here for my exam at eight. Um, so I'm going home now. My hair is like disgusting. It's, oh my God, it's so bad. Um, so I'm gonna go home, take like the shower, wash my hair, I need to shave. And then I don't have to be back here until two. So I'll probably leave my house around like 1.20. Um, yeah, that should be good. So I have plenty of time. It won't take me that long to get ready and yeah so i might go home sh like do the full shower and then go out and get coffee with like my mom and 
my sister just to like do something get them out of the house because they are just like chilling at home right now um my mom's probably literally like ironing my clothes <laughs> she complains all the time i don't own an ironing board i own an iron but not an ironing board and she's like april you have got to buy an ironing board and i'm like you know what i never iron anything i don't want an ironing board but anyway so um i am going home i should probably eat breakfast too whoops sorry matching pants too but they're a little big and a little long um, I got them in a size medium because I've got hips and yeah I'm gonna see if I can exchange them for like a smaller size but a really great brand they make their um, clothes out of recycled material which I love so very sustainable they did send these to me and reviewed them on TikTok but just a really great brand so yes I would highly recommend anyway I kind of fell off the bandwagon of vlogging like during graduation and everything because it just got like kind of crazy you know I can't like bring my camera in places but I got a few clips that I will well you would have already seen that I inserted and overall it was a really great day very exciting and yeah I'm excited to just have my peds clinical and my peds class this summer and then actually be like completely done um I don't want to be misleading, but I've said this like a thousand times, but I'm, even though I graduated, I'm not technically done. They just didn't have a graduation ceremony in August. So that's why I chose to walk, um, in May, just a couple of days ago because they didn't have a graduation ceremony in August. So I'm not technically done, but anyway, thank you guys for watching this vlog. I'm so excited that you are here and I'm so thankful for you guys and all of your support and your love and, um, it's so kind of you guys to kind of support me on this journey and the next vlog that you see will be the cruise vlog because we are going um, on Monday on a cruise from Monday to Friday so I'm excited for like a little vacation and yeah thanks for watching this video and I'll see you next time bye guys <laughs>